Kathy, and I'm a reseller on Poshmark at Picasso Cat and also on eBay at Picasso Cat Treasures. I also have an Instagram which is also Picasso Cat. Well, Halloween is over. Most of the decorations have been put away, although I think I need to get another box because um, I, as usual, we went overboard on the Halloween decorations again this year. Because every time we go to a yard sale and I see Halloween, I have to have it. Just can't help it. But anyways, um, we went to a few yard sales Friday and Saturday, but there was like hardly any. It's like less than even last weekend. Um, of course, the temperature has climbed up again. It's back in the 90s. It's supposed to go back down to the 70s, I think, on Friday, so that'll be nice. But can you believe it? November and it's still in the 90s. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, the first yard sale we went to, I picked up this really adorable costume. So this will have to be for next year since Halloween's over. But it's a little Raggedy Ann costume. It's got the mask, the socks, and some little uh, pantaloons. And, there's more, there's two wigs, this one looks like a homemade wig, and then there's this one which was a store-bought wig, so two wigs, and there's more, um, this darling little Raggedy Ann doll. And she's got fuzzy little feet. Super cute. And another little Raggedy Ann doll. And this one looks like it was probably homemade. Somebody made her. Super, super cute. And a little tiny, adorable little teddy bear. So, all that for $3. Super cute. And then the next yard sale we went to, I picked up this um, Nippon dish. And I don't know if this is a, what they call a nappy dish. And nappy does not mean diaper in this case. It just means a shallow dish. So that was uh, Nippon. And at that same yard sale, I picked up this Lefton dish. I think it's a soap dish. I'm not really sure. That's left in. And then I also got this little uh, personal creamer, which is really pretty. It has like scallop, um, scalloping at the bottom. And this is um, made in Japan by Maryland China. So pretty. And at that same yard sale, we got these are newer, and I think they're wood. I'm not really sure, but they're beautiful little birds that um, are really well painted. And then here's another one. These are made in China. I don't know if I already said that, but they're really cute, really pretty, well painted. Be nice. And they're in good condition. Then we went to another yard sale. And this one I made a mistake because I didn't look at it really good. They were, she had everything in plastic bags. And this little dog was in a bag. And I thought he was super, super cute. Look at that. There's no markings on the bottom. I believe it was made in Japan, but I'm not really sure. But the only problem is his leg, <laughs> and it's hard to see, but his leg um, was, was looked like it was glued back on. And they did a really good job. I'm trying to see what leg it was now. This leg here. It's really hard to see, so it was well done. I'll still try to sell him. I probably won't get as much for him. But he's so cute. And at that same yard sale, and this again was also in a bag, and I thought I looked it over super good, but 
I didn't notice until I got home and took it out of the bag that there is also a little chip right there. And uh, this one is made in Japan by CM Incorporated Chadwick. But I paid $3 for the two, so it wasn't too bad. And then another yard sale, and these were also in the baggie, but these are in good condition. And it was these two little tea light holders, which I don't really care for these too much. They're newer, maybe made in Japan. I mean, um, Taiwan, probably. They're probably from the 80s. But what I got, that I, the reason I bought it was for this little mug, this little guy. And he was made in Japan. And since I'm starting to collect these old uh, Santa Claus mugs now, the bigger ones and the little tiny ones, so I thought I'd get them for my own collection. And another yard sale. This was just free. She had all these uh, little jewelry boxes that were free. So I picked up those. So when I start selling jewelry, I have a lot of rings and stuff that I want to I have one myself, so I never wear them, ever. And then I also got this um, milk glass, ivy dish, planter, I'm not sure exactly what it is. It has a number five at the bottom. But it's in good condition, no chips or cracks. And, oh, where I got the jewelry boxes, I also got this little base, which I thought was really pretty. It was only 10 cents. Look at that. And um, another yard sale, I picked up these uh, oven mitts. And this is for me, since my other ones have holes in them and don't work very good. And I, since I have a collection of roosters and chickens, I thought I would pick these up. And I, that was that was it for the yard sales. I mean, it was really slim pickings this weekend. There just wasn't anything out there. And I don't know if it was because of Halloween or because of the heat, because it's uh, back in the 90s. I don't know if I already said this or not in my brain. But um, yeah, it's in the 90s right now, and it's supposed to get back to the 70s on Thursday or Friday, I think. So then I went shopping in my garage. I was going through some boxes and I found this pretty picture. Not sure if I'll sell it or keep it. I might put it in Jeannie's room, my granddaughter's bedroom. And then I bought, and I found this also in the box out there. And this I bought years ago. I was with my mother at a swap meet and it must have been, I want to say like 25, 30 years ago, it was a long time ago. So I've had her, I've had her for a long time. I used to display her, but now she's just been sitting in a box for about nine years. So I think she's gonna be going up for sale. She's got her little, little baby in the back there. She's really, really pretty. And uh, I probably will be listing her. I think she was made in Peru. So that is everything, unless I'm yeah, I don't think I'm missing anything. That was it. So, anyways, thank you for watching. And please um, put a comment down below because I love to read your comments. And uh, share, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.